Over a year, making this the best study Bible ever offered at any price. The Apostle Peter makes a bold call to all generations to be part of God's special forces team. We have done our very best to provide you with the most powerful sword of truth available. If you would like more information or to order now, call 1-800-423-1319 or visit www.remnantpublications.com. Wow, that, that little break in the commercial that you saw about, about this Remnant Study Bible, I just think it's fantastic. Um, nothing to do with me. It's a God thing. And uh, we're here with, with Randy. And Randy, I'm going to kind of go right back to where we're at. You all flew in. You flew in with two others. And we were sitting in the conference room, and you asked me, do, I, do you believe in the product that you sell on, you know, through your ministry? And, um, you know, I had said yes, and, and uh, you asked me, can you give me a little testimony? And I, of course, I mentioned that because these books by Ellen White with the scriptures had changed my life because I really wanted to get back to the Bible, the basics, and I wanted to make the Bible come alive. And uh, then you had this, I call it a smirky grin. This morning when I was talking to you before the camera. Like said, this one. <laughs> yeah, you said, well, Dwight, was it really a smirky grin? Well, it was a grin like um, you kind of almost knew all that. And then you asked the question, or you, you didn't ask a question. You said, that's why I'm here, which kind of took me back. And that's when you ask if we would do this Bible with LMI comments. And, um, and you told me something. You, you mentioned, Dwight, I want you to know, we're not doing it because you're a Seventh-day Adventist. So can you remember what? I mean, it's been a little while ago now. It's been a little It has been a while. Well, you know, I knew before I came, I did my homework. And I could see that your heartbeat and ministry was much bigger than serving just the Seventh-day Adventist right. marketplace. Yes. So yes. You, you guys were reaching around the world and you were doing it for any church yes. that wanted uh, some of the tools that you were bringing, some of the books and some of the resources. And I, I admired that. And, you know, for me, uh, my, when I came to faith at 33, Dwight, my prayer was, Lord, give me a job so big that without you, I couldn't do it. So there'd Dang be no that. question that it had anything to do with me because I'm just not that good, frankly. And I wanted to be part of something that God was Amen. up to. Yeah. And, uh, and so, you know what, I think that smirk, now that I think about it, was, <laughs> was one of those glimmers that, Lord, are you up to something? Yeah. And is this you? Because I'm about to suggest to Remnant a Bible project idea that is way bigger than me. And Lord, if you're in it, you'll make it come about. And yes. if this is going to glorify you, and you're going to do that through Remnant Publications, this you know, small publisher, you go ahead, it's small okay. publisher yeah. and Thomas <laughs> Nelson. And if you'll line that up uh, and bless it, then it can reach a lot of people. Amen. And it has, we're in 40 countries right now. I know. It's amazing. 40 countries. And yeah, we, that's a high five, right? Yeah, there. I know. I just think that's so neat. <laughs> not, not for us, but right, for the but praise for, to God that God. he allowed us to even be a part of something that's right. that has touched lives around the world. I love that. And I'll never forget when you sat there and you, then you asked it, said, that's why I'm here with that little grin. And, and, uh, and you said, we would like to see if you would be interested in doing an open study Bible, New King James, um, and put Ellen White comments because we see that she has some great in-depth understanding of the scriptures and uh, to highlight the scriptures. And um, I never forget what I told you. I sat there and I said, no, nah, I wouldn't, we're not really interested in that at all. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, tell, I told you afterwards, I said, I almost, you almost when the had table to kill me. I know, <laughs> my, my knees were underneath the table, and it's like, boy, well, I, I don't want to act, I had to bite my cheeks, I don't want to try to act yeah. too excited, but I thought, wow, because it was bigger than, we, went, we were never thinking of doing uh, an open that study That just tells Bible. me God prepared the way yes. before I even asked the question. It was, ex it was so exciting to me, and that's how we got to become friends. We, we saw each other, we traveled back and forth. You had your own editors, at Thomas Nelson, and the one thing you told us, when you have these comments, they need to be in context with the scriptures. Yeah. They don't change the meaning of that scripture. They have to in help enlighten that yeah. scripture to make it come alive in a packet, yeah. and that's why we do our Bible Alive programs. And, um, and, and not to just put the material in the front or the back, right. but to really put you know, the explanation and the commentary right in text, right with the scripture. And the design of the Bible, our team working with your team, I mean, that's a gorgeous it, Bible. Not yeah. only is it uh, aesthetically yes. really attractive, I mean, 
it's a gorgeous Bible, but the helps are so important and meaningful. I they, mean, you, you promote it's the only study Bible you ever need, but right. the truth is, it really is yeah, a it, wonderful it uh, is. resource. And, and these little comments that the camera will pick up, it was kind of a new thing that people were maybe missing when the comments were only on the bottom of the page. But as they were put in here, which we like because now they're right where the text is at, you know it's just a comment. It's not part of Scripture. Exactly. It, it, it's in a blue shade of box, so it has nothing to do with how we're, we're mixing but Scripture with you're comments. You're changing the text of the Scripture. You're illuminating it with these commentaries. Yeah, and, and when you did that, and people are reading it, and we have one big complaint, Randy, that we've gotten through email and letters and phone calls that have, no matter what denomination they are, here's the biggest complaint. If you're ready for this, they've said, you know, we would hope that when you do this again that you would put more comments in here. Mm. Because the people have said, um, you know, Remnant Publications, these comments have, have enlightened me so much to help me understand the scriptures in a, in a greater Creating way. Creating the hunger for more. It, huh? it creates a hunger for more yeah. and it makes the Bible truly come alive. So mm. we're, we're, we're so excited about it and I want to get into some things. I think one of the things that, that would be neat to say is that I, I was at Thomas Nelson just not too long ago and they said that when they got their salespeople together, and I think you was a part of that, um, they put all the Bibles out there. You have a lot of good Bibles. Yep. But they had said that they wanted to put this Bible in their premier line. In other words, it was a premier Bible. It was one of their best Bibles that they'd ever partnered with and produced. Um, yeah, really that was is. exciting for me to hear that. Well, just the technical aspects of producing a Bible, uh, the very best uh, went into the Remnant Study Bible. The cover materials, uh, the typesetting, uh, the paper, uh, I mean, it, you know, when you get it, 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 it just, number one, it feels yes. fantastic. It, you know, I think it's very honoring to God that the Bible, uh, just the design and the physical product itself is as gorgeous as it should be, but the power is in the pages, obviously. A absolutely, uh, absolutely. But, you know, we can be very proud of the fact that God allowed us to create a product that everyone will be uh, uh, you know, it'll be a, a legacy Bible that'll be in the family for generations, and it'll last forever. And it's a just a gorgeous product. But the power is in the word. It's in the word. And the, you know, the topical chain reference system that you helped uh, work with our team to design is fantastic. You got a really terrific concordance in the back. So I mean, you've got the right tools to do really serious well, Bible study. That's right. That Tom, that Thompson chain, or not Thompson chain, but the chain reference. We have 20 different topics and. What was so neat working with Nelson is because it's a Bible chain, it, everywhere in the scriptures, you'll when you see a chain, you know that is a chain to lead to, like for instance, I just turned this just now and, and uh, I see this chain and it says, um, and it tells in this chain that, that the chain is uh, 2 Corinthians 6 and it's verse 14. Well, it's, the chain's right there and then when you look underneath it, it says Christian behavior. That's what it's about. And it gives you the next text. It's a chain. Yeah. It all starts in the back. And, and the neat thing about this, it's, it not only gives a text, but it gives a little bit of what it is about in the back. So you know where the text is at. And it tells what it is. And it's about Christian behavior, uh, about even Christian dress. How should Christians dress? Mm -hmm. Is there a difference between the world and the, and the Christians from the scriptures? And uh, can you trust the Bible? And prophecy, uh, we have so many things that we have in this in this chain reference, 20 topics, and uh, it's just amazing. And and I was really amazed at how the how the Nelson people and the editors worked with us to make this to me one of the it best. It took a references. lot of collaboration. Yeah, you know, it, really it wasn't did. all you. It wasn't all us. Right. I mean, it took both our organizations working together to pull this off and to do it in a way that is uh, uh, really god honoring and reflects the best of what we both represent yes and then and the product reflects and that. the product reflects it and in the back there was that we did a 32 page colored signature but you just were sharing again with me this morning that as you travel around and you know a lot of ministries you you meet a lot of people that prophecy is still a key thing especially now there's in a america hunger. there's a hunger for it and uh, to have you know kind of the, one of the crown jewels uh you know on prophecy in the Remnant Study Bible. We uh, have the, uh, the mean, Daniel yeah. prophecies in there, four yeah. color pictures, and we have a 2300 day prophecy. Um, but Which it is, was all because it was working together yeah. uh, to, to, to create a product that people could get and unpack scriptures, make it come alive so they could live the gospel in their own homes. And I love the fact that you, uh, I mean, we actually did find a way to affordably put this beautiful four color section 
in a study Bible. That's rare. That's, yeah, because there's know, not many really like that. Rare. Exactly. And so they can actually see these statues and the beast and Daniel and stuff. And you, you, you know, I'm not here. I mean, I want everyone. I wish everyone had a remnant study Bible. In fact, I, I've got to just say one other thing, too. The remnant, even though we're remnant publications, when we went to you folks, I'll never forget this. We were sitting at dinner there at Nashville, and it, the editors and stuff, and we were saying, what are we going to call this Bible? And, um, you know, I didn't know. And uh, I don't know if it was you, Randy, that said, well, what about calling it the Remnant Study Bible? And, of course, I'm, my head's growing just a little bit big, I have to admit, a little bit prideful, thinking, oh, that's pretty nice of him. well. <laughs> yeah, Remnant Publications, the Remnant Study Bible. And then, and, then I, and then you said, well, Dwight, it really isn't about your publishing company. It's about the remnant. It's about Absolutely. people in the end. It, it perfectly reflects reading. the Bible and yes. what it represents. You know, for those that are going to be the in the end times, you know, the remnant that's going to be uh, uh, the army that, yes. you know, uh, it, it gets lifted up in the appropriate time and season. So, I mean, it, it's a perfect name for the it, Bible it as really well. It really is. I, I love it. And people have loved, we're in 40 different countries, have sold a lot of them. And um, I know that our, and that's in such a short period of time, which is yeah, just you know, a few months. Nothing it's then miraculous, yeah. you know, that uh, it's just begun for yes. people to discover this Bible. And and I think we're in pretty much all the um, Adventist book centers. We've got other Christian stores, bookstores that are buying them. And I know that um, um, even um, three, and you know, let me interrupt yes, because yes. <laughs> you don't have the package of the of the box. But you know, there's three reasons people will buy a Bible yeah. for a gift. Or to study, yes. Or to understand, yes. You know, to read or to understand. So, you you also have a Bible that was beautifully packaged, yes, in a two-piece gift box. So for, you know, for one of the most important reasons people buy Bibles, which is to bless as others. a gift to yeah. others, it's stunning. Yes. I mean, the packaging is wonderful. So, yes. I mean, that's important Amen. because you want to bless right. other people. That's right. You, 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 the Bible's amazing, but you want the gift to be packaged as beautifully as it can. And, and, you know, we also were fortunate enough to do that really well. So when you get in and you actually hold the Bible, that speaks for itself. But Amen. you've also got a beautiful Bible that fills for study and or understanding, and it's beautifully packaged. So, you know, God really blessed he, your Bible. He really did. Randy, I cannot, I cannot believe we're running out of time. Time goes so quick here. But um, I just want everyone to know, get into the scriptures, read them, study them, make them applicable to you. And you know what? If you don't put it off, you too will have a better way of life. By working together, 1.7 million copies of The Passion of Love were distributed around the country, resulting in an unprecedented partnership with Walmart that led to over a thousand Bible studies. By working together, over 6 million copies of the Ten Commandments twice removed were shared around the world, resulting in more than 20 churches now keeping the Bible Sabbath. By working together, we have shipped almost a million Bibles to spiritually thirsty Christians in Africa, touching the lives of 20 million people for Christ. Working together is what allows Remnant Publications to spread truth-filled books around the world to hasten the Lord's coming. Will you join us in that mission? Will you help us reach the world for Jesus, one book at a time?